One of the good things about Iowa is the rich black soil. It holds nutrients, but it also holds water. Piling contractors are using high-tech equipment to install perforated plastic tubing to drain water off fields. This process allows farmers more flexibility in early planting and to allow plant growth in wet years. But much of the demand for more field drainage is the result of another new technology that allows farmers to look at their land in a different way. As farmers trade up combines, so every time they trade, it, it's more and more common that it comes standard with a yield monitor. And the very first thing a grower sees with a yield monitor is it, it helps them quantify the yield loss associated with poor drainage. So it's just a great way to quantify how significant uh, internal drainage issues are. As farmers drain more fields, they are putting more water into main lines of drainage districts, which will require more investment to increase their size to channel the water away. The subsurface water coming out of the fields contains elevated levels of nitrates that can degrade water quality of streams. The water quality chief says there is a trade-off. But that tile drainage is a very integral part of, first of all, allowing us to farm flat landscapes that are more environmentally suited and present less environmental challenges than steeply sloping landscapes. And increasingly from the research studies uh, globally, we're understanding that as we move more of this excess water off of the landscapes through tile drainage, that reduces surface runoff. Surface runoff causes erosion, it causes movement of sediment to streams, and it causes uh, movement of phosphorus to streams. Tiling of fields is a long-term investment. This year, all factors came together to make it one of the most productive in history. For the Agribusiness Report, I'm Ken Root.